this is usually when I do the regional report. However, we're going to skip that because there's a lot of important stuff that I need to talk about that's more important. You guys have been asking me about this. So I want to just address everybody at one time so I don't have to sit here and like keep doing it. All right, guys, we are back in Detroit, my home city. I was looking for Dory and I found her. The blue Tang, we are ready to go. And this region is about to be fired. Jam has unlocked the power of cybers. Let's do it. We're totally geared up and ready to go. Let's go to guys. <laughs> All right, guys, so we are here and we are all registered. So the newest set, we get the newest set that just dropped Friday. As we film this, it is Saturday. But yeah, this is Chaos Impact. All kinds of stuff in here. We see here, everybody is getting ready. We got our fans in the background, subscribers. <laughs> Everybody's ready for this. We're ready. We're going to be fun. It's going to be all fun and good. So I'm going to open these packs for you guys in a second. Um, and then yeah, there's new format. That's what's really going on here. It's not as much people. I don't know why, but we'll see what's going to be happening. New format, um, new set. So it's a lot of exciting stuff happening in the game right now. So I'm excited to see what's going to happen today. You guys know I already got my invite, but I just want to see if I can top. That's what I really want to do. Like top, top, like top eight. That's how hard we gunning today. So let's see what we can do. <laughs> so, with the new format that just settled, we had about two weeks to see how things are kind of going. What do you think are like some of the best decks right now and decks that have potential? Uh, right now, it's very difficult. Uh, the trap decks uh, like yours and the Marine Cess and Toad and... Uh, That's in the frogs! <laughs> frogs! Uh, and Alter Guys have gotten a little bit of a bump. At the same time, Combo's still trying to find its way. I know it'll make it back eventually. It's a question of how long. Uh, Striker's pretty much out. I mean, True Draker can add into it a little bit. Uh, so it'll make it at least a contender, but don't think it's going to be top. Uh, apart from that, oh, we've got your rogue strategies that are going to be fun. So. Honestly, anything, nothing has really changed. I mean, Orcas still keep going. Thunder Dragons now have a little bit better because they can just do Thunder Dragons. And Stride Strikers, nothing happened to them. So really, it's just basically well, who gets the who gets the the hand hand traps and the mirrors, and that, that basically who wins. I think Orcus is probably the best deck. It's graveyard based. Like you really can't stop a lot of their plays from this time unless you have Lancia or Necro Valley if you're weird. So Orcus just like grinds out better than most decks, which I think is really good. Uh, I thought Thunder would be good, but then like us play testing and all the Thunder monsters on their own are like really bad. Uh, you have to have other good cards to plus off them, which is what makes them good, but you can't really do that most of the time unless you have a blur or an instant fusion or something. Or other. So Thunder's like tier 2 right now. Sovereign Grace is always good. Uh, Roar and Rage are just good cards, and good cards will always be good cards. True Draco is always going to be good because Floodgates are always going to be good. Uh, Guru is fine. I don't, I don't really see it do anything. Uh, Sky Striker will probably find its niche somewhere. I have a hard time believing one way Winger actually kills the deck because Mystic Mine is still a card. But as far as like top two, I'd probably say like Orcus and Sovereign Great. They're, they're too consistent, they grind so much better than every other card. And Sovereign Great will always be good in a format where Levianir isn't played anymore. So. All right, thank you. All right, guys, so we are at the Detroit Regional and we are on this latest set, which is Chaos Impact. So when you enter a regional, if you guys are new to this, you always get for $20, five entry packs of the latest set. So you have a chance to get your money back. And as always, guys, if you are interested in these packs in this set, use the link in the description to get all of this stuff on TCG Player. So without further expense, let's open this. This set has a lot of stuff. I'm going to, I did a box opening for you guys too. I don't know if it aired or not. But yeah, we got this stuff. This is what I've been so waiting for. As you guys know, I've been talking about it for months. Um, they got a lot of the new remakes of a lot of old archetypes. Like there's some Gladiator Beasts and stuff. Speaking of which, the Crystal Heart. This is like literally the heart of the new Marinces deck. Um, they made some new Dream Mirrors. This one's not that good. Love the artwork on this thing. Um, and the Unchained, AKA Hakai. They changed the name of it. I don't know why, but Hakai was the um, Japanese word for destruction. They're now called Unchained here in the TCG. But they basically like destroy themselves and they get advantage for destroying themselves. So I've heard people mixing it with True Draco and doing all kinds of crazy stuff. So we'll see. I don't know if it's going to be really exciting and good. 
more dreamers, especially this too. I don't know if it's gonna be good, guys. I haven't seen anybody doing anything with it, but um, oh great, I needed another one of these Mandarin. So yeah, a lot of new stuff into this set. Nothing's really generic except IP Mascarena. She's really cool. She basically makes your she's like a formula synchron that makes all your um Link monsters that you use as materials immune to things by um it can't be destroyed by battle or sorry card effects. So that's a really good generic card that comes in this. But a lot of stuff is arch eye specific, like more of the Marinta stuff. Um, they got some new of the Galaxy Eye stuff. Which is odd, because that's in Zexo, and then we're all the way in Brains now. Love the artwork on this. I don't think it's a good card, but... Oh, and they even made some new Solomon Gray stuff as well. What? Wow, that's really old. Tingy stuff, Tingyu. And last one, guys. All right, come on. We got to get a secret rare. That makes it worth it. Dun 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 dun. Flip it for the suspense. Dun 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 dun. It's another dreamer. Why do I keep pulling the dreamer stuff, guys? I don't know, but as always, guys, stay tuned. And if you want these stuff, remember use my link down in the description. Stay tuned. All right, guys. So this is usually when I do the regional report. However. We're going to skip that because there's a lot of important stuff that I need to talk about that's more important. Plus, it's the question of the weekend, so yeah. So yeah, first thing that I wanted to address, a lot of you guys have been asking me about this. So I want to just address everybody at one time so I don't have to sit here and like keep doing it. So what happened to Team SSD? They disbanded, guys. Like They were a team that I was sponsoring, and like I told you guys, they were their own team, and I was just their sponsor. They, for their own personal reasons, have decided to go their separate ways. Sometimes all good things must come to an end, and everybody's got to handle their business. Some of them have school, work, and other obligations that they can't always be doing Yu-Gi-Oh! And it, I understand that. So if you guys want to know more detail what happened, just ask them. And yeah, like, that's pretty much it with that. So yeah, another thing that, guys, I keep on telling you guys this to make sure you uh, hop on the bell notification icon so you don't miss any totally awesome uploads. By that I mean hit your notifications, turn them on, because YouTube is not promoting a lot of content creators anymore. By that I mean they're showing you different things. Even if you're subscribed to somebody, you might not see their videos. A lot of people don't know that about YouTube right now, but basically, unless you have the notifications on, you might not see my videos for like, a couple weeks even if i posted a video today you might not even see it so if you really care about seeing the latest of the latest make sure you hit the notification so you don't miss them so another thing that's going on like i mentioned to you guys before if you guys haven't heard i have a new partnership with tcg player it's literally like all you got to do is click the links in the description i'll put them directly in the links and on my channel page you will see them on the top of the channel art, you'll see a lot of links and you'll see it as the first link. It's simple, all you gotta do guys, it'll help me out if you guys use those links. Literally just, I might be talking about a card throughout the whole vlog or whatever, and just go on there. Like, I mean, if you wanna get some blue tangs cause that card just came out and it's hot, like go ahead, order them. They have so many things and it's basically like the Amazon, like it'll just ship it to you. And you can even optimize your cart so you can like find the best prices for everything. So make sure you guys do that and support me and it helps us out. The other thing, I, a lot of people have been asking me a lot of questions specifically. Like they want to sit down and talk. And the thing is guys, I'm one person and I don't always have as much time. And I always message people message me on Facebook and on Instagram all the time and we talk and you guys know that this is a community based channel So I try to talk to with you guys all the time With that being said if you guys want to have an actual phone call conversation with me where we can just talk about whatever you want to talk about I can help you with strategy. I can just talk about my experience playing the game If you guys don't even want to talk about Yu-Gi-Oh! You want to just talk about business entrepreneurship anything Spanish because I tutor Spanish in the link in the description, there is a link that says call Jam or talk to Jam. If you have an iPhone, there's an app called Magnify, and it is down in the description. If you click that link, you guys will get five free minutes to talk to me about whatever you want for however long. And then after that, it will charge you a rate based off of the minutes. Or if you guys want to just email me and we can schedule a call and talk if it's more deep and intense that you guys want to talk to me about something longer, so you don't want to be charged per per minute, 
then let me know. We'll work it out. But guys, like, my time is, like, divided with everything I've been doing. I've been doing my best to keep everything on level grounds. But I love talking to you guys, and that's why I tell you guys, come talk, chat with me at regionals and all the time. But if you guys want to help out the channel in, talk to me and get to pick my brain with the expertise that I have of all of the topics and things that I'm good at. Even video making. Some of you guys have YouTube channels on different things and you guys want to learn how to do that. Just let me know. We can talk. We can schedule a call. And, like, yeah, it'll tell you when I'm available. And then if I'm available, I'll answer the phone and we can just chat. So that's something that a lot of you guys have been asking me about. Yes, we can do that. But yeah, so about the, the Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's get to Yu-Gi-Oh! now. So what's happening, like I said in the game, new set just dropped in. The, the two big things, new set, ban list. That's what's happening right now. So it's kind of crazy because you guys know I just got my invite. If you ding the notification bell, you know that. But I got my invite on in the last video vlog. And then long story short, I've been waiting for the ban list to fix some things. And I've been waiting for this new set, Chaos Impact, to drop so I can play my Marincis and the Frogs. And I'm not sure how I'm going to do today because I didn't really have much time to practice. I've been looking for Dory. Oh, the Blue Tang. That's the name of the Dory fish. So Marincis is a Blue Tang. I've been, I'm calling her Dory. I've been looking for her all week. And then I didn't really have much time to play test. So I finally got my play set. And we're good to go. So I'm not sure how I'm going to do today, to be honest with you guys, because I haven't played in about two weeks ever since I got my invite. Format is different, but similar. So we're going to see how I do, guys. I want to get a top eight, dude. That's my goal for the year. Like, I want to try to top eight in the event, whether it is YCS or regional. That's my goal, guys. So hold me accountable. Like, I can get my invite. I get my invite every year, but I want to, like, take this rogue stuff to the top of the top and i think i can do it i just gotta practice more and do some stuff so stay tuned guys let's see if i do it it has begun let's do it all right guys we did not get that round yeah man i made some mistakes guy played around in biru he's playing sadly but yeah i'm still trying to get used to the deck because like i didn't have as much time to practice with it as soon as i got my invite that last time guys i just kind of took a break and waited for the set to come out so i didn't have as much time to practice as i wanted so we'll see how i do today it's gonna be eight rounds and it's almost like 300 something people really short today it's usually nine rounds but we'll see what happens top 32 so i want to try to top eight but like i don't know we started off with one went loss already so i'm not sure how that's gonna work Maybe I can get a double invite. I don't know. We'll see what happens, guys. I'm just really just trying to play test and see how this works at the actual regional event. I'm already seeing some things I want to change around, though. So we'll see. Stay tuned. Got that one, guys. So, yeah, that was a really long game one that ended because he should have scooped and he didn't scoop. And then basically, like, it was a minute left on the clock. And then I summoned Zoroboros with, like, 9,000, and I just smacked him for game. And I was like, you should have scooped, fam. I keep telling people to just scoop. But, hey, guys, so we got that one. Let's stay. All right, guys, so that top eight thing probably not happening today. So that's X2 with a tie. That's awkward. All right, guys, so I just dropped because the deck, like, it did a lot of what I wanted to do. But because I just rushed to come play, as soon as I got my blue tangs, I just didn't have time to like actually theorize and play test some stuff. And yes, I know I've been talking about it for months and whatever, but like I didn't play with the new cars until they come out. I usually don't. Maybe I should start doing that a little bit more so I can like have some idea of how things go. But like it was well, it performed well. I just didn't do everything I wanted because some of the ratios were a little off. And I wish I would have spent a little bit more time trying to like tweak it the way I wanted to. But it's all good because we got a whole bunch of stuff coming up and i'm going to do my best to like i said try to top i really want to top that's my goal hey look at that example 40 in the background <laughs> what's up so yeah guys like my goal is going to be to top one of these events coming up soon so i'm gonna be tweaking i'm gonna go back to my factory and cook some stuff in the lab to try to get the best ratios and the best way to play the deck so but for now it was all right i had a lot of fun got to see you guys got to chat with you guys and it's always great coming out to these things so i uh, love you guys support hey you 
don't forget to subscribe because it'd be totally awesome if you did because you guys by subscribing sharing and following me on social media you help continue to create this totally awesome content and i love you for doing so make sure you guys check out the description box below as well because there's all kinds of new projects that jam one is up to and i would totally mean the world to me if you checked it out so yeah i'll see you guys next time enjoy life more than awesome he's totally awesome